Good morning, New Life Fellowship. It's day 26 of our 40-day fast. Two weeks to go and we're done. We can eat whatever we want. Um, hey, I just wanted to uh, shoot a video this morning and encourage you in something. During these times where we're kind of quarantined to home, maybe you're still working, which is great, but um, there are a lot of people that are quarantined to the house and a lot of people are on unemployment, like 20% right now. And so chances are some of you viewing are stuck at home on a day-to-day -day basis or maybe even work from home. And, uh, and obviously your normal patterns in life have been interrupted. So I just wanna shoot a video here this morning on just some tips to fight depression because that's one of the enemy's tactics to really bring us down mentally. And so let me give you some thoughts here on, on fighting depression. Number one, go to bed on time, you know, set a bedtime. So, uh, and then honor it. Don't stay up until all hours of the night, totally change your sleeping patterns and stuff because that can really affect you. And then second, along with that, is get up at a set time in the morning. So set a bedtime, set a time to get up, and make sure that you get plenty of sleep. So for me, I like to, I like my bedtime to be like 11 and be up at the very latest. You know, you can get up around six or seven right in there. Um, and then after that, get a workout in, go work out. Work out is working out is one of the greatest ways to avoid depression Man, it gets all of your, I mean, you, you start to sweat. It gets your, um, your body active and your muscles, uh, moving, uh, increases heart rates, blood flow. It's just a great way to start your day. And then after that, come up and, uh, and eat a healthy breakfast. We have more time. So let's, let's prepare a breakfast. Um, something that's healthy instead of like sugary cereals and different things like that. Um, and then spend time reading your Bible. You know, after you have your breakfast prepared or whatever, pull out your Bible and begin to read. Have your journal there available and write down some prayer thoughts and, and then talk to God. So get your, your prayer time and your, uh, your Bible reading in. And then I, I would challenge you to do this is to take every thought captive because there's always these thoughts that try to control us. And so take every thought that's contrary to the word of God and take it captive. Know who you are in Christ and run with that. Um, set some purposeful goals for the day. I talked about this a little bit last night at our prayer uh, simulcast, but identify some things that need done around your house or apartment and, and get some stuff done. Maybe it's work-related stuff, and check those off of a task list. There's nothing, for me, there's nothing that feels better than putting a check mark in one of my tasks, uh, knowing that I accomplished it. That really helps, helps us, our psychologic uh, health. So, um, and then lastly, reward yourself with something, whether it's fun, or it's a favorite movie, uh, or a snack but reward yourself after you've accomplished a day of purposeful living. So I just wanted to give those to you. I hope those help and uh, fight depression during these times. Don't let the, the devil uh, and our own flesh overcome our psychological feelings during this time. Let's be victorious. God said this in Romans 8, 37, overwhelming victory is ours through Christ Jesus, our Lord. I hope you have a fantastic day. And we will talk soon. God bless you.